Good morning, YouTube. What is going on? Happy Saturday, everybody. Got a bunch of people in here already. Thanks for coming out. Uh, hope everybody is doing well. Um, yeah, catching up on the chat. Zach, good morning. And we have a new member to the um, Breakfast with Brian uh, collecting. Uh, definitely go check out his channel. If one of your mods can drop the link for um, uh, collecting with dirt, is it dirt? Dirts? Um, good friend of Scotty Vaughn, uh, S Vaughn 82. So definitely go check him out. Uh, X11 Bravo, good morning. Just kind of catching up on the chat. I thought I saw another new face in here too. I'm not sure if Madam has been here before. So welcome. Good morning. Thanks for coming out. Um, yeah, everybody's saying hello. Appreciate you guys coming out this morning. Well, we got 13, 13. Very nice. Uh, main event, David, good morning. <laughs> yes, the uh, the wake up, uh, the alarm uh, of the dancing, uh, screaming man in the intro. Naman, good morning. Thanks for coming out. I'm just uh, trying to catch up on the chat. Everybody's saying hello to everybody. Appreciate you guys coming out. Uh, we've got some stuff to do today. Got some new comic books um, that I read this week. We've got some shout outs to do. Um, we have uh, CBC Awards update. So a bunch of, bunch of stuff, the normal stuff. We'll do a giveaway too. So uh, Phil, good morning. Uh, JG50, good morning. Jay. Just catching up. Oh, and Mr. Comic Journey. If you haven't seen the interview, uh, I need to go check that out. Comic uh, Journey um, was on my channel yesterday, part of the Comic Book Community 411. Great interview. Journey just came back to the community and he's been on fire. Uh, I think he's back about a, about a week and he is definitely, uh, definitely need to go check him out. Jimmy G, good morning. Um, yeah, just catching up. Let me just get through the chat. Um, Scotty, good morning. Jonathan. Yeah, just trying to catch up. Cole's here. Good morning, Cole. <laughs> I think last week you were having chili dogs for lunch and now you had breakfast. You had some pizza for breakfast. But if you guys are hungry, we, we do serve breakfast, so... Uh, we'll go, we'll start with the pancakes. Now, if pancakes aren't your thing, you can go, you can have the. If you want to eat a little healthier, we can go, we can go with these. Or. Uh, yesterday was uh, National Donut Day, so. <laughs> uh, yep, yeah, so breakfast has been served, so uh, hopefully you guys, um, there's something there that you, that you enjoyed. Um, uh, <laughs> Yes, that's why I try to eat my breakfast before the show because if not, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't make it through. <laughs> yeah, pancakes. Uh, every Sunday, I make pancakes for the for the family. Well, it's kind of dwindling down. It's basically my youngest son now, so he gets to eat all the pancakes. So, um, but hey, we have um, like I said, we got a bunch of different things to get to this morning. Neil, good morning. Um, we have. Um, why don't we start with the shout outs? Um, they're, um, you know, always like to support other channels. So let's let's start there. Get this channel a sub. So um, a couple different shout outs to do. Well, I have the three and we normally do three shout outs. But um, I wanted to mention that Gary B, the casual comic guy and link is down below. He did a video last night, a live stream um and kicked off the third phase of the grow together initiative 
Um, like I said, the link is down below. He did a ton of shout outs for um, a number of community channels, you know, some under 100, some under 200, under 300. So definitely need to go check that out. Link is um, link is below. Um, so definitely need to go check that out. A uh, bunch of great channels that he mentioned. I need to go back and make sure that I'm subbed up to all of them. Uh, comic book channels, some card channels, a bunch of just great, great, great channels. So um, definitely need to go check that out. Um, but the first channel I want to mention today is actually a, uh, a card. Well, he does, he does cards, uh, card collector, but he's starting to dabble. He's gone back and grabbed some of his old comic books and he's visited a comic shop this week for the first time, uh, in a long time. So it's a surfer. Um, you've probably seen him. He sometimes shows up here. He's in Hawaii, so it's a little bit early for him, but, uh, He's got a great channel. He does a lot of short, you know, rip pack rips, um, but it's a surfer. Uh, he's in Hawaii. So, um, and sometimes he shows some really great um, backgrounds um, when he's shooting some of the scenery in Hawaii. So it's definitely a great channel to watch. So definitely go check him out. Um, and then the next channel we have is, um, I think I've mentioned this channel here before, but just another great channel that I've been watching, Just Your Average Geeks. Um, and he does it like a weekly comic book haul, uh, haul and review recommendations of some of his top books. Um, so definitely need to go check out that. Like I said, links are all down below. So definitely go give these guys um, a, um, a look if you um, are not familiar with them. And uh, the last channel I have for this week is Shop for Comics. Now, Shop, uh, sometimes he, he shows up on the show. Um, he is another great you know, community member, big Spider-Man collector. Uh, he's actually on a goal to try to finish uh, his amazing Spider-Man run. He's been picking up some under 100 books uh, recently. He's been doing some mystery boxes to help fund um, some of those purchases. So uh, if you check him out on Instagram, he's done um, some mystery boxes. A number of the community members have purchased those and, and unboxed them. And they've been really, really great um, mystery boxes. So um, definitely need to go check that out um, to, uh, you know, support him. Uh, just another one of those um, great channels. So um, definitely go check those channels out. And like I said, check out Gary B's a video from last night. The link is in the description. He shouts out a bunch of channels. Um, so definitely need to go, you know, check him out. Um, yeah, just trying to catch up on the chat, making sure I'm not missing anything, any questions for me. Uh, it looks like everybody's talking to everybody. Appreciate that. Yeah. A surfer is a great channel. Yeah. He, he just, you know, it's, it's what I love about his channel is, um, just some of the scenery sometimes that he is showing in the background of Hawaii, just beautiful beach and, you know, ocean, th those type of things. Um, but he's, he's always got, um, he seems to be going down a bunch of rabbit holes in collecting. I think he picked up a first pop uh, yesterday and now he's going into comic books. So he's got comic books, pops, cards. It's, it's great. You know, and that's, it's, it's, um, you know, it's cool to see. Jerry, good morning. Thanks for coming in. Um, let's see. Who else? I just want to. Yeah, I have it. I'll, um, Jimmy, I can send it. Whose comic journey needs it? I'll send it over. I have that. Um, I have your shipping info from, I think, a previous previous win. Um, so just catching up, making sure I'm not missing anything here. Yeah, his shop's um, mystery boxes. Now, he's done two rounds so far, and all of the boxes I've seen were amazing. And like I said, I know he's he's using that to help fund you know future purchases for his PC. Like I said, he's trying to work on his um, amazing Spider-Man run, so it's, it's pretty cool to see. <laughs> cool. Definitely check that out, Cole. Yeah, Gary did a great job last night. You know, he's he's kind of the, you know, he's the originator of the Grow Together movement, the, you know, hashtag Grow Together. Um, he, he's one of the, you know, main reasons why I, I like to do shout outs. Um, you know, I saw him doing shout outs early on when I first started YouTube. Um, Rob the Recon um, does, you know, shout outs. 
Um, so th those were two guys that I had found very early on and um, kind of gravitated towards and, um, you know, really enjoyed the idea of, you know, the shout outs, paying it forward, grow together. Um, so it's, 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 you know, it's fun to be able to highlight other um, channels. Yeah, if somebody, one of the mods, I think, um, Scotty, you're a mod. Drop his. Oh, it looks like Neil's uh, taking care of it. Drop, drop the link for. Um, I just subbed him up uh, this morning, so definitely go. You know, drop his link in too, and we'll we can feature him on a future um, a future uh, shout out show as well. Yeah, a bunch of, you know, um, channels hitting milestones. Uh, Mad Spidey, uh, Naman just hit, uh, well, he's past 200. A um, bunch of different giveaways. Um, two, one thing to check out is Metarog's channel. Uh, Roger, he does kind of a weekly update on all, um, like, uh, milestones and giveaways that are going on within the community. So, um, <laughs> yes. Um, the check, uh, check is in the mail. Just uh, be on the, be on the lookout for it. But I just want to make sure, you know, I, I might have had your old address. And so it may take time to get forwarded to the new. So, you know, don't, uh, you know, don't wait by the mailbox for it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, look at me. Look at me. <laughs> the look at me movement is back and we have the grow together um, movement. So, um all good things in the community. And it's funny, you know, Gary mentioned it on his stream last night. He's like, doesn't cost you anything to sub to somebody, you know, watch other than a little bit of your time watching, you know, one of their videos, hitting a like, leaving a comment, um, all free things to do. So, and, and great way to support, um, one another. So, um, yeah. Uh, like I said, if, yeah, if one of the mods wants to drop, um, collecting with uh, dirt's link you can do that um so definitely um and so let's talk some comic books uh i read a pretty good stack of books trying to catch up on some reading for the last like two weeks uh first i read uh the closet so this is a new um uh, image book uh james uh Tynion. Uh, really, this was a good read. You know, a lot of people were talking about this this week. A um, lot of um, kind of hype or anticipation around the book. And it was pretty good. Good, good. You know, the closet, right? There's something lurking in the closet. So you definitely want to go, uh, if interested, kind of, a, you know, it's it's early in the story. But, uh, you know, obviously, if there's something not supposed to be living in the closet and is, it's it's kind of a little bit of a horror type story or alien. We're not really sure yet. Um, so definitely you want to go check that out. Um, Ghost Rider 3. Love this cover. This reminds me of uh, uh, what was the Stephen King movie um, with the uh, when the machines came alive and it was like the Green Goblin truck. But look at that. Uh, the big rig with the, the, the teeth there. So this was this was a good read. Uh, Ghost Rider's been OK. I have not previously read too much Ghost Rider main story. Um, so that was, that was a pretty good read. Um, strange number three, love this cover. Um, this has been fun. This has been a, um, a, a fun read so far, three issues in. So definitely, um, worth a read, uh, righteous thirst for vengeance. This is eight. Now this was, this kind of took a turn. I mean, this has been kind of a, Kind of a violent story, um, but this issue was really um, kind of took a turn. Um, um, kind of very, very violent uh, <laughs> and graphic in in this issue. So, uh, and it, there's not a lot of dialogue. You know, they're kind of telling the story with just the art and the panels. Um, so it's been a very quick read. The whole series has been a, been that way. Very, um, very quick read oh maximum overdrive yeah yeah that was it i couldn't think of the title right but the um i remember the image of the uh of the 18 wheeler with the it was like the green goblin you know head on the front of the uh of the truck um but yeah so that's what that the ghost rider reminded me of um so 
<laughs> Crank up to ACDC. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I haven't seen that in a while. Um, you know, I remember it more, uh, you know, as a teenager, but I probably need to go back and take a look at that. Um, yeah. Strange was really good. Um, enjoyed it. The storyline's been good. Um, with Clea filling in for, for Dr. Strange and trying to figure out how she can bring uh, Strange back. So that's that's been fun. So a um, couple other books that I read, uh, kind of catching up. This, I think, was from a week or two weeks ago. Spider-Punk uh, number two. I love this cover. Um, this has been an interesting read. You know, obviously, it's a different take on, on Spider-Man. And they form the uh, Spider Band uh, this this in this issue. Um, so this has been an interesting read. You know, a different, obviously a different uh, Spider Man and um, team. Uh, but 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 that's been fun. Uh, Captain America. So this is symbol of truth number one. You know, this is the official Sam Wilson. You know, taking over the mantle of Captain America. And what was interesting reading this 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 was a good read. Um, just kind of a, you know, a out on a mission type story. Um, but what was interesting was he's partnered with the uh, Falcon, our new Falcon, I guess. I just wasn't aware of it. So it was a bit of a surprise for me. I'm not even sure who um, the character is. So I need to kind of go go look that up. But that was that was interesting. Um, like I said, just kind of a fun read, just, you know, out fighting crime type um, story. So that was um, that was fun. I haven't seen the. I hear it's Top Gun is really good, right? The the new um, the new uh, movie that came out, I think, just last weekend. I, I hear you know everybody really kind of gushing about it, talking really well about it. It's done really well, so um, I'm definitely interested in you know love the first um, Top Gun movie. Um, so definitely looking to check that out. Jones, or good morning. Thanks for coming in. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, it, it, and and it, it's funny because there, there's a lot of like references to bands and, you know, there's kind of these different groups within that within that book um, that are all kind of like, you know, rival bands. It's 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 been it's been an interesting read. Fun read, though. There's definitely some, you know, some references and Easter eggs in it. So. Um, so just kind of catch it. Dale, good morning. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate it. We got a bunch of people up in here. Appreciate everybody coming out, just catching up. Aggressively is here, aggressively relaxing. Thanks for coming in. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 it it took me a little while to kind of get into the story. I haven't read, you know, I knew of the character Spider Punk, but haven't really read anything of the his storyline before. And so it it kind of it takes you a little second as a, you know, as a Spider-Man reader to kind of um, get into the story a little bit and kind of wrap your head around a, a different Spider-Man and universe, but it's been fun. Some, some interesting char characters. So. Okay. Yeah. I wasn't sure. You know, when I saw um, the Falcon here, I wasn't um, sure who the character was. So I definitely need to, um, Kind of check that out. It was definitely interesting. So another book I read, um, Spider-Man 2099. Um, this was okay. Again, this is, you know, as a um, Spider-Man reader, Peter Parker Spider-Man reader, um, you know, these these other Spider-Man storylines kind of takes me a minute to kind of wrap my head around it because I'm so, you know, old school with Peter Parker. But that was that was an okay. Spider Man twenty nine was was okay. Um, Iron Fist three. Um, this has been an okay story too. I haven't read, like I said I haven't really read much Iron Fist um, previously, so it takes you a little while to um, kind of get your head around some of these characters. A lot of these characters I know from reading Marvel Team Up and things like that over the years, or you know reading books where they're kind of. Um, you're making guest appearances and not the main story. So it does take you a little while to kind of get your head around um, some of these characters. So, um, <laughs> well, 
Well, no, if I haven't seen the movie, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to watch that yet. <laughs> uh, all right. Let me catch up on the chat here. I see everybody, um, um, talking. We, we were talking about, uh, <laughs> Spider Punk. He's one of the alternative. You know, he's the different, um, different universe Spider Man. So, I don't know. I, I don't know, Journey. You, you might like it. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of references to different bands and things. Um, punk rock, you know, rock. So you definitely, um, there's definitely some, um, some Easter eggs in there. You know, references that if you're not familiar, you, you know, they'll go, they'll go over your head. So, um, <laughs> I figured, I figured as much. And, and even for me as a, as, like I said, I'm, you know, I grew up on Peter Parker, Spider-Man, uh, you know, so reading some of these different stories is, um, takes me a little while to get my, uh, head around. No, we're not Yankee fans. We are, uh, well, at least I, I'm not. I'm a Met fan, Mets. So they're not doing well out in L.A. right now. So <laughs> uh, just catching up. Southpaw Brad is here. Thanks for stopping in. I know a, bu a big group of guys are, uh, you know, community members, I should say, are getting together down in uh, North Carolina at the end of the month. Uh, Heroes Con. So if anybody's planning on going, um, there's a big group, uh, South Paul Brad, uh, Circumstance, uh, Tylux, a bunch of people going. So you definitely need to go, um, you know, connect with that group. I, I mean, Pocan Joe, um, there's, there's a big group that is um, heading to that con. We have a couple local cons coming up, Terrific Con, um, obviously New York City Comic Con in uh, October, so definitely a lot of uh, a lot of cons out there happening. So, um, oh, Journey, you're a Yankees fan. Damn. <laughs> All right, Jimmy G. Now we got to get you on Instagram. <laughs> Baby steps. Uh, thanks, Neil. Appreciate that. Yeah, just catching up. So, um, no, I am not. I am not heading down to Heroes Con. Uh, it just uh, didn't work out. We were just down in South Carolina a few weeks ago uh, visiting some family. So I'm just, it's, whether I drive or fly and then hotel and everything, it kind of just eats up the budget to actually buy some books. So I'd love to go hang out with everybody, but um uh, just gonna lay low for that for this one we you know we like i said we, there's a bunch of local cons coming up so um um just you know ones that i can you know drive to right here locally so um i'm gonna uh you know go oh, garden state comic fest yeah somebody else had mentioned uh that to me that um there's an uh so that's in new jersey there is um eternal con which is on long island um so a bunch of great uh, cons that are coming up. So, yeah. Uh, and so I, I've almost done with all the books I read. Banner of War, part one. So this is kind of the Thor, uh, Hulk crossover, you know, battle. This actually, this first issue, this is the alpha issue, was a fun read. It's really kind of just Hulk and... Um, Thor, you know, battling it. So that was, that was fun. Um, and then I read, um, Hulk number seven. So the continuation of the story. Now this is a crossover between Hulk and Thor. So there's two issues of Thor that tie in and two issues of Hulk. I didn't pick up the Thor issues. Um, so I just read, this is kind of part three, part one. Uh, I'm sorry, this is part one. Then part two takes, uh, takes place in Thor's book which I didn't pick up, but then I read part three and, you know, you kind of get the gist of the story. So I just hate, you know, I, I don't regularly collect Thor. So I'd rather not pick up the um, crossovers books that I would normally not keep in the PC. So uh, I didn't, I didn't pick that up. 
Uh, and then the last book I read this week was uh, Moon Knight. This is the reprint, Moon Knight number one. And this is um, this is interesting. You know, th- this is obviously the reprint um, just to see the old, you know, kind of style dialogue um, panels. Um, but that but that was fun. So. Well, yeah, I mean, you know, so the next two issues, seven of the Hulk, seven and eight are basically the, the tie ins um, to the Thor storyline. I mean, you can, like I said, you can kind of get the gist of the story without reading the Thor books. Um, you can kind of see what's going on in it. And it does tie into the current storyline of Hulk. So um, it, it's um, I think you can get away with just with just the Hulk stuff. So. <laughs> we miss Wolf Wolf too, Jimmy. And we miss you. Um, but in in Jimmy's in Jimmy's honor, let's um let's brighten up his day with this. You down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? Who's down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? Who down with LCS? So there you go, Jimmy. That's for you. <laughs> um, so yeah, that was the books I read um, read last week. Um, Jacob, good morning. Thanks for coming in. Um Comic Book Community Awards. That's what I was trying to think where I wanted to go next. I appreciate everybody coming out. We got 24 people here. Um, big group this morning. Master. Wow. We got Madam and Master here this morning. I appreciate you guys up early in uh, in Arizona. I appreciate it. Appreciate everybody coming out. Chop and drop. Good morning, sir. Um, yeah. So Comic Book Community Awards. Um, nominations are still open. Um, last I checked, we were about 140 ballots have come in. So definitely need to go, um, need to go, uh, if you haven't submitted your nominations, please do, do that. We'll do. Yep. We'll do. I'm going to be running a giveaway shortly. So yep. X11, uh, noted. So, <laughs> Uh, so, uh, comic book community awards nominations, like I said, are open. We're about five weeks in. We have about seven weeks left for the nomination period. Um, definitely a number of close, um, uh, votes. Um, I, I just kind of quick, took a quick look. There are some patterns, some, some clear front runners developing in some categories and other category categories are wide open. So definitely, um, every nomination will count. So please, if you haven't, um, and let me do this, go, um, get your nominations in cbcawards.org. Um, and I want to thank a bunch of the sponsors. Um, we have a number of community members who have donated and have become, um, mem- uh, sponsors for some of the award categories. So, um, just to make sure I don't leave anybody out, let me just bring it up. So, uh, Digger Jim, I want to thank Thank Digger Jim for his support, Minutia Minute, um, X11 Bravo, who's here. Um, they recently donated and are sponsoring uh, two different award categories. Um, Comic Bookworm, thank you for your uh, donation and support. Uh, Cole, Cole's Comic Claims, who's here in the chat, uh, he's also a sponsor, so I appreciate all of that. Um, the sponsorships help fund some of the, you know, trophies and, and prizes for the winners. So I appreciate everybody, um, who's supporting that community support. Um, yep. Just trying to catch up on the chat. So, um, yeah. So comic book community wars, like I said, just really try to, you know, if you haven't get, um, submitted your nominations, and I know people are you know, still, you know, thinking about a lot of award, different categories and making some, um, you know, educated decisions on who they're nominating. So I appreciate that. Flo, good morning. Thanks for coming in. 
appreciate everybody shop. Thanks, shop. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Did a shout out for you earlier, so glad you were able to catch it. Um, a mystery link. <laughs> uh, oh, thanks, Naman. I appreciate it too. You know, it's been fun. Um, you know, it's it's always uh, it, it, it's it's good because I'm discovering channels from people's nominations that maybe weren't on my, on my radar. So it's, it's fun to see the, the nominations come in. Um, so really, really cool. Um, yeah, I think I'm almost caught up on the chat. So definitely comic book community awards. Um, like I said, go, go, go nominate your favorite channels, creators, if you haven't done that yet. Um, so yep. And, you know, sponsorships are still available. If anybody's interested, I thank everybody who has already um, uh, donated and has sponsored. Um, like I said, those help um, fund, you know, the trophies and some of the prizes for the winners. So I appreciate that. Um, yeah. Cool. Thanks, Shop. Have a good one. Uh, and I think, um, let me see if there was anything else. Comic book, community awards, books, shout outs. I think I covered pretty much everything. And now I have been spending a lot of my time watching the New York Rangers in the playoffs. Um, games have been every other night. Both of their first round, uh, first and second round series went seven games. So if you haven't seen me a lot on some of the live streams or chats in the evening, uh, this is why uh, the Rangers have been taking up a lot of my time. They won again last night, so um, which is which was it's it's been fun. Uh, my wife and I have been watching the games. My brother's a big Ranger fan. We actually went to one of the games down in uh, Raleigh against Carolina uh, two weeks or so ago. So it's been uh, it's been fun. Uh, there's nothing like uh, playoff hockey, but. So, like I said, if you if you don't see me in um, your live stream during the week, uh, this is why it's been eating up a lot of my time. But since we're talking hockey, we're gonna do a hockey themed uh, giveaway. So let me share my screen, and we're gonna do um, where is it? There it is. Hashtag. LGR, let's go Rangers, and we will pick out a prize and, and winner. So, um, <laughs> nice. They're looking good right now. I mean, um, you know, up 2-0 in the series, so we'll see. Catching up. <laughs> uh, Journey, you know, you, there's a lot of views on that video and a long watch time. So I appreciate it. It was, it's much a must watch, uh, you know, YouTube when Comic Journey is being interviewed because, you know, we learn a lot about you in that, in that video. So if you ha haven't seen that, go check it out. Uh, Comic Book Community 411, new uh, episode dropped yesterday with Comic Journey. Uh, and if, uh, you know, I'm, I am reaching out. Uh, to other community members to be a guest on it. But if you'd like to be, just uh, send me a message and we'll we'll get you scheduled. Um, so, what a comment. <laughs> That's okay. Even, uh, you know, I don't, I, I'm not, I don't mind. Even a Pittsburgh fan can, can, uh, can win here. I don't, I don't, you know, I don't discriminate. <laughs> Oh, you're a Yankee and Islander fan. What, what, uh, Journey? What's your football team? Do you like football? Who's your? Don't tell me the Jets. If it's the Jets, then I might have to kick you from the stream. <laughs> oh, all right. Let me just catch up a little. We got twenty people in here. Looks like we got sixteen comments. If you guys want to get in, jump in, please. Hashtag LGR. Let's go Rangers. Uh, we'll run this in a second. Oh, all right, Bills fan. At least that I'll. That's respectable. <laughs> Maybe the only New York team, right? Since both the Jets and Giants play in New Jersey. 
<laughs> oh, Cole, come on. Jets. No, it's 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 good. I mean, we again, we're spoiled. We've got so many sport local sports teams between football, we've got 3, hockey, we've got 3, you know, baseball, we've got, you know, two. I mean, we're we're definitely spoiled uh as far as uh sports go. So <laughs> yeah, Jacob, I think what Jacob's won what two out of the, I think the last four giveaways. So, uh, we got a Favre guy in here. How are you a Favre fan? And if you uh, you're in you're in South Carolina, you don't like the Panthers. All right, let's run the giveaway. Oh, I might have to unsub you now. <laughs> uh. Yeah, it could be, but you know, we'll 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 see. Uh, there's you know there's some other exciting community members out there that I think you know could give you a run uh, on the interview. So we'll see. They did. Giants did have a good draft. Um, I'm liking the way the team is uh, getting put together this year. Um, so yeah, this is true. They're the only team that actually plays uh, in New York. So yeah. I think there was a petition out to try to change the the Giants name to the New Jersey Giants, but I don't think ever anybody was going for that. So, <laughs> all right, so let's run the giveaway. Good luck to everybody. We've got nineteen people entered. Here we go. South Paul Brad, <laughs> congrats, sir. He, um, I just hand delivered a giveaway uh, from my 600 subscriber giveaway uh, to Brad uh, when I was down in South Carolina um, a couple weeks ago. So, congrats! <laughs> yeah, rigged. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, all right, so let's uh, let me stop sharing and let's go to the prize box here, the short box of comics, and we'll pick out Brad's books. Let's see. Up first, we have Fantastic Four three hundred and sixty-two, little Spider-Man Human Torch on the cover. That's book one. Let's see, book two is, oh, there you go. Conan the Barbarian, number six. Let's see, we'll go random here again. Oh, there you go. Star Wars, the High Republic, number five. Two more, two more. Ooh, this is a 24, the one shot from the Fox uh, TV series. That's a nice, thick, thick book, too. And then last but not least, let's see what we got. Oh, this is the Flash, number 123. I believe this is a um, re reprint, a DC Millennium Edition. Very cool. Classic uh, Flash cover. So congrats, Brad. I'll get those out to you. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I think that is about it for today. Um, just let me catch up on the chat. Um, oh, no, we got a lot. I started a lot of football uh, football talk here now. <laughs> uh Yeah, I think it's going to be. I think it's going to be another interesting football year. I, I'm, you know, with the USFL happening now, I wonder if there's any players that will, you know, find themselves on a, an NFL roster. So, but always looking forward to um, to football football season. <laughs> yep, I'll get these out and. Um, Actually, just waiting on a new batch of um, Comic Book Community Award stickers. 
So if any, actually, um, I think they're arriving today. So if anybody uh, needs a sticker, would like a sticker, let me know. I'll get them out, sent that out to you. Um, I hope so. That's that's my hope. <laughs> bills look good, though. I mean, um, Bills did, you know, they did lose a few players, but, um, you know, they their offense is, is pretty good. Um, so we'll see. I'm, I'm, I'm glad that the Giants – grab some of the uh, personnel coach and, and GM from the bills because, you know, they've been successful. So we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Dan Campbell is good. He's a tough guy. So. Uh, I use sticker sticker mule. Um, and, and I usually only buy when they send me a, you know, like a sale. Um, so I just, they had a sale was, um, 50 stickers for like nine bucks. Um, so, so went for that. Um, it's, it's usually, you know, if you subscribe to them or check out their website, um, they run some crazy, um, they run some crazy, you know, deals and that's usually when I'll buy the stickers. So David, all right, I'll get you one. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I think Cole has that. I think that's, that's available. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a that was a, a a good trade for them. So yeah, I think the Eagles are going to be tough this year. I think your know, Eagles are going to be tough. Cowboys have been competitive, um, and then you know I'm, I'm hopeful that the Giants kind of um, progress this year. That you know kind of start to get it together and a little bit more competitive. So oh, I mean, look at this. We're it's June and we're talking football already. <laughs> uh, Phil, thanks. Yeah. And oh, re reminder, Phil, Phil, I think you've got a show right this morning. You do a show uh, around 11 a.m. or 11, a little bit after 11. So definitely go check out Phil's live stream uh, this morning. Go support him. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. I'm going to wrap it up. Just kind of catching up on the chat before we head out. Um, yeah, Cole, I think you need to feature the, the mustache or maybe just a mustache as a sticker. Um, I think that'll be, uh, that'll be pretty popular. So, um, but yeah, hopefully everybody has a great, great weekend. We've got some great weather here. Um, got my to-do list to do. So, uh, going to go get to that. Um, and like I said, if you haven't, you need to go check out the highest rated comic book community 411 interview with comic journey. Um, the one, the only comic journey. You have to go check that out. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Well, you've you you've been uh, Philly's been been very competitive over the last couple of years. So, Super Bowl win a couple of years ago. So, Zach, yes. Have a great weekend, everybody. Uh, appreciate everybody coming out. Like I said, check out the links down below. The channels we sub subbed, uh, shouted out, sub them up. Check out Gary B's video. Um, and we got some other great stuff in the community today. Slab Hub. Uh, I believe Spine Ticks is um, on for tonight. Uh, so go check them out tonight. Bunch of great stuff. Jimmy, have a great weekend. Um, what are we going to leave with today? Let's see. Um, we'll leave with, let's see. We'll leave with the other dancing women of LCS. Have a great weekend, everybody. Thanks for coming out. You down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? Who's down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS?